Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Please excuse the noises. Uh, that was just either a car or a motorcycle, a very quiet motorcycle going by my house. Um, if you guys are wondering why I'm talking solo, it is around 10, it's 10.16 right now. So people are starting to settle in to go to sleep. I decided to do a really quick video tonight about what I have bought. I did recently go clothes shopping, so I do have a whole bunch of new clothes I'm going to show you. I'm only going to show you just a little bit of what I got. And then hopefully next week I will show you the rest of it. Some of it is in the dirty laundry, so I can't... I'm not going to show you the dirty laundry part. So, yeah. If you guys are well, new here, welcome. Thank you for stopping by and checking out my channel. My name is Steph Marie, and if you guys are wondering what I have in store for you guys for this video, please subscribe, like, and leave a comment below. I do have my drink over on my bureau, some apple cider, warm apple cider. Yes, I am one of those people that do not like pumpkin, so I turn to apple cider instead. With that being said, if you guys are wondering what I have in store for you, let's get on into the video. So, I'm like, so you guys might see some glances of some stuff, but other than that, there's not very much. So with that being said, we're going to get into the video. I will show you guys what I bought, the sizes, and just basically, yeah. I will not, however, tell you the prices of what I, what they were, because some of the stuff I do not remember, and I honestly don't think it is a priority to say the prices so with that being said this one's going to be a little bit hard to show you but i will do my best i'm going to see if i can do like a little stand here perfect so this is a long sleeve shirt kind of like a brownish burnt color it looks red on the camera but it's kind of like a dark brown it does have a little choker very soft long sleeve light it also has some slits right here so instead of being a full shirt it is cut on both sides of the shirt if I can get the other side right here I have already worn this that is is a medium if anybody was wondering and it's very soft very light I have I am starting to do a little bit of the um fall and winter shopping, I do have a couple of dresses that aren't fall, or some of them could be fall, some of them are more, you know, spring, summery, but they were on sale, and I'm probably never going to see those dresses again, so I did pick them up. Um, another thing that I actually just bought are, in here, I actually used my own money. To buy the gift for myself, if that makes any sense, but my husband picked them out for me. I don't know how to explain it, but you guys might tell me that I'm crazy and I probably should have gotten a pair of these ahead of time. But I am, I do own Converse now, as you can tell, it's kind of like a basket kind of weave all over them they are kind of like a orangey 
yellow, more yellow though, if you guys can see that. Not sure how that, how well that's going to be turning out. Those are the bottoms, nope, okay. But, I just got these yesterday? Yeah, yesterday because I wanted to wear them today, but I couldn't wear them today, and unfortunately I cannot wear these to work. Which is a sad, sad, very sad adventure there, but I do like them, I like them a lot. Um, they are a size 7.5, and I am usually a size 8. I have tried them on, they do fit very well, and, yeah, so that is the Converse's, I don't know what to pair these with yet, yeah, these can go with a lot of shoes, a lot of outfits that I have actually, and, Maybe I'll save these for, like, a special occasion. I don't know yet. I'm still trying to figure that out. So, when I figure it out, I will let you guys know. I don't really like how the box is so, like, small. If you guys understand what I'm, where I'm coming from. Like, who put sneakers in that size of a box? Converse. So the next one I'm going to show you is going to be falling more and more when I go when I'm done with this pile, only because the pile of shirts I have for you guys is holding up my phone right now. I could possibly do it on my sneaker box, which I'll probably try that right now. Kind of putting you towards the closet so that way there is no spoilers. How's that? Better. Okay. So this one I've worn once already, and I've gotten so many, so many um compliments on it that I love it. It's like a peachy, peachy pink color. It does have its shoulders cut out, so it kind of looks like, like that, there you go, same on the other side. It is on the heavier side of a sweater, it's not itchy, it's very, Very stretchy, as you can tell, it stretches quite a bit, which is awesome. I do like how there's like a ridge knitting here, and then a completely different stitch all around the neckline and the cutout line for the shoulders. It also has a on the bottom of the sleeves and on the bottom of the sweater. That's a very nice sweater for like a 70, 60 kind of day weather. Not too hot, not too cold, you know. This is a really good sweater for that. It is a extra large if anybody is asking what size sweater this is. And like I said, it's not very itchy at all. It goes perfectly with, like, a black shirt or something like that you guys can wear at all. Now, this next one is that my co-worker actually gave me this one. I have a, a couple other shirts that she has given me and some shoes as well, which I will later on do that video for that section. But I just grabbed this out what the rest of the stuff that I bought so I'm just gonna throw it in there just to for giggles haha's and stuff like that so she has already she's cut this to the point where she would wear it as like bedtime or like going out somewhere or something like that 
And that's perfectly fine because I've worn this very, very much. It just basically kind of just comes down off of one shoulder like that. And it is Looney Tunes, so when I wear it, it just kind of comes like this or like that. You know, you get the picture. So it is Looney Tunes. It is a gray. It does come quite down pretty large. It is a size large. It fits me awesome. I love it. I've used it for bed. And I'll probably keep this as my sleep shirt. I don't know yet because I do. I am running out of, like, pajama stuff. So I do have to go buy some pajamas. And, yeah, so this is Cricut again. So, on to the next sh shirt. This is basically the same color shirt as the other, the other sweater I just showed you. It's like a pinky peach. Um, nothing much to it. I like the color. I like how it was made. It is a long sleeve sweater. Pinky peach. This is a large, I think. Oh, cool. But this is like a large, I do have the same color, I do like how this is like all cut out and strappy right there if you guys can see that clearly. That's just cut out with a piece of string and I like, I like this shirt so much that I got it in a gray as well. This is an extra large, which means this is probably also an extra large. The uh, size isn't on there. I haven't worn these two yet. I have worn something very, very similar to this. has the same exact idea with the lace, but it, you can't tie it up. It's already there. This is like like that. It's maroon and white. It is stripes going horizontal. I've worn that many times. That is actually in the dirty bag, but and again, this is probably most likely a large or an extra large. It is a pinky peachy color, and I got the same one in heather gray, extra large, only because I like the shirt so much. That I just needed it in another color. There she, I have already folded all these, but since I am unfolding them, um, so I can show you guys, I will be refolding them. I do have another shirt somewhere that I can't find right now. It's probably somewhere. It is a large, a long sleeve shirt. And, like, from here, from the shoulders down to the sleeves is black. So I do wear that with my uniform sometimes. It is probably somewhere. I'm going to hurry this up because my husband's getting out of the shower. And I want to go get in the shower probably. And I just relax, probably color a little bit. And, you know. So the next one is just nothing, nothing special. Just a large white t-shirt. You can never go wrong with a t-shirt, so I just picked up a couple of these. I haven't worn these yet, this one yet, but it does feel nice and comfortable. Doesn't feel like, doesn't feel, the fabric doesn't feel like it's going to be itchy or anything. It is a large for those who do have questions. I don't remember what come came from where but I did buy all of this at um, PCX and Mad Rag over by Walmart on Boston Road. It some all these were on sale except for one thing but it was still pretty cheap that actually still has the tag on it. So some of these you are going to be able to tell where I bought it from because they do have the store's tag on them. So I do hope you guys enjoy it. Now I just bought another regular t-shirt in like a whiny maroon kind of.
kind of red. I would call that more like a wine red. A uh, deep wine red, I should say. And again, I don't think this is going to be scratchy because it's basically the same exact shirt, same exact material, just a different color. Next one is a, is a like an olive green sweater. Again, it's got that ridge to it. It's got, I don't think you can really see that, but it has a cutout on this uh, shoulder, but it is sealed with some string to seal it with. My husband's being weird right now. <laughs> you can come in, hon. It also has the same pattern right there. I have worn this at once. It's not scratchy. Very comfortable. If you guys hear squeaking in the background, ignore that. That's just my husband. <laughs> now, with that being said, I'm going to be moving on to the other stuff. Like, again, I'm not going to be getting really much into it. I'm just going to show you the pieces, put it aside, move on, and pretty much. This, as you can tell, I bought it at Mad Rag. They do have other colors there. It is a faux leather jacket. I got my sister-in-law one exactly the same color and same size. This is a medium. I have tried it on. It is a tad bit tight, like right here, but that is okay. I don't really mind that. It's just basically for like a fall. This one is a army dress with a hood on it. It says Queen. Um, don't remember where I bought this from, but like I said, everything that I'm showing you, other than that, Grey Looney Tunes shirt I bought either at Mad Rag or PCX. I've worn this, this is very comfortable, not itchy at all, extremely perfect for like that early fall type of day. It's just I liked it because of the buttons, it has a cool design on the buttons, I don't know if you guys can, are going to be able to see it, uh, nope, you guys can't. I am doing this at night, so I am trying to hurry it up a little bit. I haven't worn this yet. I have gotten a second dress. Same dress, different color. This is like a burnt orange. This is more like a teal. Haven't worn these two yet. I am planning on wearing them sometime soon. But... As of right now, not really. Now, this is a color that I don't wear. I don't think it looks nice on me, but I am willing to try it. Anyways, this is a orange dress with some tortoise, tortoise shell buttons on it. It is a little bit of a high neck. From what I can feel, it's not like a bad fabric. It's not itchy. It seems comfortable. I have haven't worn this one yet, but I am planning on wearing it. I was going to wear this today, but it didn't happen. Now, the next one is completely out of my zone with the um, sleeves and Probably the length, I'm not 100% sure, I haven't tried this on yet, but it might be also the length. As you can tell, the sleeves are a little bit puffy. It is like a lilac color. It doesn't look itchy or scratchy, it looks quite comfortable. 
I did get this at Madrag, it is a medium. Not really sure how it's going to fit me though, I haven't tried it on, but hopefully one day I will. Anyways, with that being said, this is the end of the video. Hopefully I will have another video up for you next week, Monday. And with that being said, I will see you guys later. Bye.